it's the holiday season, the happiest time of the year, but also the most stressful. And you have so much on your plate right now. But if you wanna put nutritious, delicious foods on your plate without any of the fuss or time in the kitchen, then you wanna try out Factor Meals. Go to factormeals.com slash HRU50 and use code HRU50 for 50% off. Now get back to your holiday shopping, feeling full and satisfied and knowing that you just ate something that was good for you. Do you have any public uh, sex stories at all? And if not, do you have any public places that you would love to have sex in? That's um, like on your bucket list. Yeah, I'm in Spain for some reason. You I had want, sex in public? No, in Spain. I want to. You That's want like to? That's like on Spain. my bucket list. Okay. Yeah. Have you been to Spain before? I haven't. I want to do it for my birthday this year because it's a big one, unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I would like to do that for my birthday. So we'll see how that goes. Maybe I can find something like a one night stand there for all you Spanish guys. <laughs> all right, Spain, you know, get ready. Look, right? <laughs> Is it just because you want to go to Spain? Or? I, I just think like the whole thing, like, I don't know, Spanish guys are hot to me. Yeah. And like, I like the accent. Uh -huh. I like to be talked to in a different language. Actually, it doesn't really matter what language. I just like dirty talk, yeah. you know, that way. Um, but just like I've seen pictures of places and videos from other girls that posted stuff and I'm like, oh my God, could not imagine having sex in certain spots there mm -hmm. would be amazing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So but you're thinking of somewhere with like a view. Yeah. You know, a not, view. not like a back alley. Or of even a bar. well, no, even like some of like the alleys, like the old alleyways, you know, that mm -hmm. are all cool and yeah. pretty, you know? Okay. That could be fun. Yeah. Sneaky. All right. I'm going to manifest that for you. Yes, please do. <laughs> <laughs> um, do you have any like crazy sex stories at all, even from set or just from your personal life? I get asked this question all the time and I've always, I can't ever think in, you know, like before porn was in the back of a truck bed, somebody was driving it around in the country while we were fucking in the back. That was pretty cool. Were they driving slow? I hope they were driving slow. They were driving, I, honestly, I can't remember, but. <laughs> there, there couldn't have been a lot of stop signs. No, it was in the country. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So that was cool. They were on a paved road, right? Uh, Yeah, paved road. Yeah. I'm like I was like, wait a second. Like, yeah, we were on a paved logistical road. Logistical yes. issues that would come with that. <laughs> yeah. Um, On the beach, on Venice Beach. Um, I will say, like, for me, you know, sex on the beach is something that people romanticize a lot. Yeah. Um, it's not as fun as you think it's it going to be. Absolutely not. You sink in the sand. Mm -hmm. sand <laughs> and then when you get vagina. up, you have it everywhere. Vagina. Yeah, for yeah. days, not just like. <laughs> yep. Yeah, it's pretty rough. Yeah. I remember it's it was not like. as sexy as you think. <laughs> right. I remember it was my dream to always shoot on a beach. Mm -hmm. Um you know, ever since I started shooting and it, it was, you know, I was like 20 years into my career or 18 years into my career before I shot on a beach mm -hmm. and it was <laughs> a nightmare. Was, yes. Yeah. Yes. I'm it sure. was. I mean, it was a solo for Playboy too. So it oh, wasn't wow. even like a sex scene, but it was like, it was hot. Oh. It was windy. Oh, um, wow. It was really hard for me to see the back of my camera, oh. uh, the sand and everywhere. The girl got stung by a sand wasp. Oh no. <laughs> that sounds terrible. <laughs> It was, oh it was, but you know, I will say it was Chloe Ture, who's like one of the toughest models I know. And, um, she did, she did really well with it. Oh, but, uh, good. yeah, that was, that was, whoosh, yeah, I'm rough. sure. If you're like me and you're constantly on the run, you do not have time to spend in the kitchen to craft nutritious meals. This is why I love factor meals. They are delicious and they are good for you. And it prevents me from taking that dreaded trip through the drive through to get something very, very bad for me. So if you want to take control of what you are eating without spending any time in the kitchen, go to factormeals.com slash HRU50 and use code HRU50 for 50% off.